Oh no! Welcome everybody to Pumpkin Days with Zora. This is episode 129. We are going to feed this kid before we do anything else. Because otherwise he will get all squawky again. Do you reckon he could eat an entire cauliflower and broccoli bake on his own? Let's try. Woohoo! He'll be into that. My gosh, have you ever seen such a mess? No? Well, there you go. Cooking channel. We are learning how to make kumquat cookies. Actually, that would be nice. They'd have a little bit of a bite to them, I think. Check in our backpack for... Ah, uh, yes. For animal products, we need to stuff in the fridge. Uh, I'm not sure I can put any more in this fridge. No. See what we're going to do? We're going to pull the bananas out of here. And the beans. And the cucumbers, actually. Anything that's really not a um an animal product. That I think I can fit in my other fridge. There's my collard greens and my walnuts. I did not need any more. What a surprise. Those of you who know me are like, well, duh. <laughs> well, duh yourself. Alrighty. Let us go with fruits in the fruit fridge. Which I'm really pleased to be having these inside where they're easy to access. And we'll put the veggies in the veggie fridge. Wait, didn't we say nuts were fruits? Yeah, I'm a little bit slow on the uptake there. That's fine, because the fruit fridge is just right here. We, we don't have to worry about missing it. Sort it all out. We can see a little bit easier what we've got and what we don't got. Sort this one out. Black beans in the veggie fridge. Sort that one out. There we go. We do not need any more black beans. Okay, let's put fish... Right, so what I wanted to do was I wanted to put the feta in the animal products fridge along with the butter. Now it fits. See, if we sort it all out, it looks a little bit more respectable. You know what? These um, these herbs can be not in here. We are very gradually just putting things where they need to go. I need a jam fridge. We should make it red. Eight o'clock in the morning and I received something in the mail. Okay. I don't think I need too many more fruits. What do you think? Alrighty. Wander this way. We're going to put the, um, the herbs and spices in the herbs and spices fridge. We are going to put the fruit and the fruit fridge. Um, whoops, looks like I missed some herbs and spices. I'm not sure what to put olives under. How about under the fridge they fit in? And the veggies go in the veggie fridge. We definitely do not need any more onions now. Why are the dates in the veggie fridge? We, we're not going there. In the baking fridge, we want the things for baking. In the spices fridge, we want the spices. Um, I am going to put the veggie oil in here. Because fish and chips, okay? Alright, everything's looking a little bit more respectable. I'm trying very hard not to, um, yeah, not to put things in the wrong space. Let's head on down to here. Baby's on the back, in the backpack.
There's a tiger beetle over there. But it's not the tiger beetle that I'm looking for. Okay. Payment for the shipment. Completing the honeydew task. Completing the cantaloupe task. Completing the chicken egg task. And getting a special bag of seeds. We are such good bunnies. All right. I want to go and check on my um, my spider experiment. So before I chicken out again, come here, Smogster. Oh, you are such a good pony. Let us go and see if the black widows have transformed into some other kind of spider. I know, it's a long ride. We'll just zoot over. I'm going to drop the saw stag beetle off before I forget. We're just going to go diagonal. Maybe not diagonal, straight into that rock. There we go. It does not take very long to get over here. It's just I, I very often find that in real time I prefer to take the um, the tuk-tuk because it's quicker in real time than it is actually in game time. So we will drop our saw stag off in here. Oh, there he is. Uh, I'm going to donate that. And we'll get this pony out of here before it hits 11.30, otherwise there will be poop. Now I could go into the Clementine, but I'm thinking... Okay, there's two things. The first thing being that I need to get the last fall fish and the last... Uh, the last fall lake fish. Which is a better fish. So uh, we can go up here. And we might just do that on the way over. Hopefully it won't take too long to find it. It's in the morning too, and I'd rather try it in the morning when I've I've hunted for it in the evening and not found it. Uh, this is also a good spider spot. I'm thinking we might check out some of the spiders there. Just in case there's a garden spider. I know, there's invisible walls along the water lines. You just need to be careful where you ride your pony. So we're after a better fish. Because the better fish is our last full lake fish. So there's our koi. I wouldn't mind riding back from the spider spot with um, in the dark because we can also check out whether or not that theory that the wolf spider appears in the dark is, um, is, is a solid one or if I'm just, you know, talking through my hat. Okay, here we go, we're going to catch all the fish that we caught before. To be honest though, the better fish does take a little bit to get. Oh, and we want to check out those red back spots in the... Um, in the, in the Lucky Pine as well, because I remember changing a few up there. Do, do, do. I know, nearly there. We, to finish this off, we would need a gold carp, a better fish, and a, um, an alligator gar. There's our gold carp. I'll tell you what, if we get the, uh, the better fish before the alligator gar, I'm not hanging around. We should have a fish pond. Or a fish tank. That'd be pretty. I had friends who had a fish tank once. They used to 
put their, their koi in like the small little fish tank. And then when it grew to the size that was good for that one, they would put it into the next size up. And then they would transfer it until they put it into the pond with the other really big koi. It's very cool. I know. Sometimes when, it, when you don't hook a fish, you're standing there going, oh, am I fishing in the right season? Ooh, old netting. Actually, uh, we're going to need some old netting. The ultimate bug net that we're using is, is wearing thin. Oh no! The last thing you want is you're hunting redbacks and suddenly it snaps. That would be bad. There's my alligator girl. Now we just need the better fish. Silver carp. Oh wow, two alligator gar in a row. I mean, you get a few of them, so koi, more koi. More silk cup. And walleye. And a lake eel. Super cup. Come on, guys. I know they're all hiding underneath the decking with the goldfish. The better fish is sitting there going, No, you bite that, you're all crazy. I mean, they're right, but come on. Yes. All right, we are so out of here. That is what we're after. That took in game time. It took about two hours. Let's just shovel up the poop. We don't need to advertise to the world exactly where we were at this time. Smoky. All right, hang on a minute. I have got it parked a little bit too close to the lake. Just, we'll just move her over here and um, and then we'll pick up the poop because really horse responsible pet ownership okay now I was thinking maybe we should look at some of the spiders in this area just in case some of these guys were um, garden spiders Wait, where'd it go there it is right there oh, I think it's this one's a Venusta green crab spider okay but right, I'm pretty sure that that is not a um 
a garden spider, but we're going to catch it anyway. To me, that looks like a zebra spider. Oh, that looks like something right there. Let's just grab that. The green links. Zebra jumping. Beautiful. As that looks like another green links, but we'll grab it anyway. So I'm thinking that this patch um, it's not a bad bet for different spiders. What's that? That looks like a a, a wandering thing in me. What's it? Did I catch it? A, yeah, brown recluse. Man, I'll get it right eventually. Wandering thing in me. What's it? Goodness me. Alrighty. I know the music is so soothing in this game. I love it. When you've had a long day in the word mines, it is perfect. Alright, what is that? Okay, I think it's just flowers, yeah, just flowers. Do you know what though? I have not seen red back, sorry, black widow spiders in this patch. It's always the, the much nicer spiders. What is that? Cat face. There's one over here. I think that's a green lynx. No, it's a green crab. There you go. Alright, so maybe maybe the spiders come out in like little families of spiders. Huh. Let's call up the pony. Um, and we'll see if we'll see if maybe the um I know, I'm gonna be trying to find a, a little grey spider in the grey half light. I don't have a flashlight. That's okay, we're going to do this anyway because I really want to see what this experiment of mine has brought up. Let us suit this way. Ah! <laughs> Into the trees. I know sometimes those stairs are a little bit hard for my pony usually when I'm carrying the baby so we're gonna go for a little moonlight run because we're crazy out to catch spiders in the dark hmm not sure who's the crazy one let's um while we're in this neck of the woods do you remember that little junction in the trail that I said we should watch for this one so all right so that one respawned as a black widow that one respawned as a black widow. Uh, I'm pretty sure there was one out here, wasn't there? They were. There were three, like really close together. All right. What did I say about trying to find little grey spiders in the dark? Okay, that one respawned as a Black Widow as well. All right, so either they're a really common respawn, and they just might be, or we only find Daddy Longlegs out near sunflower patches, or we only find them in the um, in this this wooded area here. Now it's night time, so we hopefully will ride past a really scary wolf spider. We'll see. Yes! All right. So that's the only spot I've ever seen the wolf spider. <laughs> oh my god. That scared me. So maybe there are just a couple of places where you just get these one thing. All right. So which means we better be really careful coming up this trail here. Okay. We'll just cut in a little bit because uh, this one likes to sit right next to the path. 
Oh, where'd she go? Oh, no. I saw it. Where was it? There, right there. Okay, so this, this should be a Daddy Long Legs. Because it's not a Black Widow. Yes! Awesome! Okay, so, okay, so, so far we've ascertained that, yes, in this area only, the, um, the Black Widows, if you despawn them, will occasionally respawn as Daddy Long Legs. Oh, awesome. That was worth the trip. Now I just need to work out where the garden spiders are hiding. Okay, so I'm just going to wander this way. Okay, this one respawned as a Black Widow. But... I think... I think that... That might be another Daddy Long Legs. Let's check it. Yes. Yes, yes. All right. Oh my gosh. I don't know how many of you already knew this, but this is like the first time I've ever had to catch them by myself. The cats caught them for me last time. Uh, so now I'm really curious as to if anybody has seen a garden spider because I have never caught one. I've always had my cats catch it. This one here, this is where we had the bagworm caterpillar. But if you have a look now, it's respawned. As a daddy long legs. All right. So I think what we've just got to do is work out where the... Um, where the garden spider is and I hope it's in the game um oh actually there's one other spot we haven't checked isn't there uh, where did that one go okay is it just around the rock there was like a black widow around here as well. I know, now I'm a little bit scared because I don't want to get bitten again. Chicken. All right. Okay, well, we've, we've definitely verified that we can catch wolf spiders out here. Just one. In one spot. Ooh, where'd it go? I don't see it anymore. Did I scare it away maybe? Alright. Maybe I haven't gone far enough. Pretty sure it was there in that spot there. Unless it's further up here. Okay, so that wolf spider, that's going to be really hard to find. Because it was there when we rode past it. And now it's gone. Wow. <gasps> okay, no it's not. I was in the wrong spot. <laughs> oh man, I'm such a cowardly custard. Alright, so yeah, there you go. The wolf spider I've only ever seen in that spot and only ever at night. The daddy long legs I've seen both day and night, but you have to despawn the um, black widows if there's black widows there instead. The garden spider I have never found, although I've completed the collection, I've never found the garden spider. It's always um, been something the cats have caught for me. So I, I really hope that that's not the case. Oh, wow. I am really pleased that the, um, to, to, to actually be able to find where, the, where the, those spiders belong. Um, okay, it's past midnight. I was going to go for a little explore in the, in the maple leaf and minty stone woods, but maybe not tonight. 
Uh, tomorrow we need to do some deep ocean fishing. Okay, down to Wahoo Beach. Yes. Okay. Alrighty. Now I think, okay, Smokey is occasionally not smart enough to go to her own stable, but apparently she is tonight. <laughs> Let's pop Zane on the couch. Hopefully he won't get too hyper while we grab a little bit of evening cooking. Kidney bean soup, anybody? Grab him, little rat. Come on, into bed with you. And let's let this little character get some sleep. Maybe not, you know, that little. Okay, let's grab the baby before he starts to wail. Do banshee imitations. We will feed him. We we'll need to do some cooking anyway. Uh, Brussels sprouts casserole. Here, kiddo, try this. Oh, we like that one too? All right. I don't think he's a fussy eater. He's pretty good. Cooking channel, pear jam, yummo. Okay, where is he? There he is. All right, I'm going to leave him in there for a minute. What is in my backpack? Oh, right, that's not good. All right, the only thing I need to keep is this. Everything else can get shipped. Uh, no, let's lock that camera back again. Sorry, I hit the U key by mistake. I meant to hit the I key. Uh, the J key? The I key. Something like that. I like my Larry fridges too. I really want to get some more of that um, stuff. Right. Sell all of these. We don't need to get any more autumn fish except, come here you, what was in the um, ocean. So we might head out there. I know, I did not mean to gather those flowers. Ah, uh, I have fish and chips. Oh, the black zigzag curtain can go. Radio. I know, hello pony. Uh, did I get mail? No, I didn't get mail. We're going to head on down to the ocean. After I check out this tree. Well, it's on the way, isn't it? Oh, it has still not respawned. Well, that's sad what about this one okay fine it's going to be like that is it <laughs> okay let us go ocean fishing for i am missing a cod what cod were a winter po uh, winter pony a winter thing come on harmonica i don't think i've taken you out in the boat before you'll love it Out to Piscari Isle. Yes, please. If you live in uh, Pumpkin Vale, just pop the pony here, and you wish to gather some oranges to grow, you may toddle up here. Or if you wish to gather some oranges to use, actually, I've forgotten if you can actually use these things. There's some oranges here. I think I bought a bunch of them, so I'm not going to worry too much. Um, but, oh, wow. You know what? I am going to worry much. I mean, why leave it when it's all here? Look at that. You can usually find a tablet here in this little space. Um, I have already found it, so it is not there. But uh, if you have not found it. Yeah, then that is a good spot to go looking for it. It is nice to pick up oranges. I like my orange grove up here. It's very pretty. Right, it's not my orange grove, but you know, it's mine when I'm here and no one else is. There we go. We can make some orange juice for the kiddo later. Maybe um, orange candy, although I don't know if I want to give him orange candy. He might turn into a brat. We are hunting cod. Let's go find some. Just put that up there. Sea urchin radio. Oyster. I like that way. It won't let me. There we go. It won't let me adjust it so I can look out at there. 
Awesome. So we are looking for cod. Music has gone quiet. Red king crab. I may need that for cooking, don't I? Sea cucumber. Don't think I need that for cooking. We'll check. Seaweed. We do need that for cooking. Sushi. Oh, another red king crab. Part of me keeps thinking cod is an autumn, uh, a winter fish. Wow, I did not think red king crabs were that common. I, I'm obviously wrong. So we've now caught all of the spring, summer and autumn fish for the lake and the river. We've caught all of the spring and summer fish for the ocean and the deep ocean. So now what we're doing is we're just trying to catch the last um, the last fish for the autumn ocean. Uh, and then we've got a ton of fishing waiting for us when it comes to uh, when it comes to winter. We've got to do all of the, the lake fish and all of the ocean fish for winter. Which, which, to be honest, isn't that long a list. Which of these worth? 20G. 25. 100G, that's quite good. Oysters are worth 80. They're a good starting thing to sell if you're um, in Wahoo Beach. The oysters... I oh know I keep pocketing my fishing rod, that's got to not be helping with my fish. Greening, nice. I know the music's gone completely. Stingray, awesome. There we go. So I kind of wonder what this square is. Sea cucumber. So what I'm thinking is for um, Bailey, we, she may need a little place down by the sea, just in that ocean block, uh, in that beachfront block, so that she can crash, because it's a really long way back to Diamond Falls. Um, and if she's got her plots at the back of the town, so she's got quite a long way to run. So what we'll do is we'll have, I think we'll probably end up with having a, um, a little house in Pumpkin Vale and a little house in, in, um, man, I'll get there eventually, in Wahoo Beach. Not sea urchin. No. And scallops. Oh. Yes, I'm pretty sure that's what we're after. Alrighty, we are done with our autumn fish. That is so good. Come on, harmonica. All right, so now we just have the bugs and we have to work out these garden spiders. Um, I'm thinking, actually, I've got a vague feeling that they might be around the... I keep thinking they're around the temple. Oh, that's what I want to do. We're going to go and see if we can um, visit the minty stone woods. So I guess to do that quickly, Eugene, I have a delivery for you. You borrowed it from Duante. Well, you're a pain in the neck. 
I know, there are these people who borrow from everybody else. <laughs> it's like, it's not mine to lend, but I'll lend it to you. What? Completely alien to me. You borrowed it from Rashida. See, you're another one, aren't you, Duante? Tell you what, though, on the upside, you do get to learn where everyone is. Where did Rashida go? Oh, okay. Uh, no. No, no, no. Are you get done? to learn their routines from all the different things. She's pretty good. All right. Anything else we should know? Okay, so we definitely needed to get the... Oh, do I? Have I still got them? Let's go find Kaishan. Kaishan. He should be up at the library. Or he's still at his shop and he's about to go to the library. No, he doesn't go to the library. He goes to talk to um, Thingamie What's It out on the beach. Jabala. Kaishan and Jabala. So let's wander this way. And we'll see if Kaishan is in his store. Because I don't think he is. But he might be. No, he's still in his shop. He likes horses, right? How lovely. You're welcome. Pray that I don't accidentally burn it. Anyway, here are some more sewing patterns, as promised. How are you doing? How long did I spend studying fashion? Gorgeous fashion studies. Uh, cool. A black hoodie. Thick framed glasses. What else we got? Ooh, a black frilly shirt. And, wow, friendship. Whoa, that is pretty good. Okay. We are going... Let's hit pumpkin veil. Yep. I know it's a bit late in the day, but, um, oh, wow, it's very late in the day. My bad. That's okay. Okay, so we're going to go out to, what I want to do is I want to check where these spiders are over in this area. Uh, and I want to see if maybe garden spiders spawn out this way. I honestly don't remember where I've seen them apart from the cats which are good kitties alrighty garden spiders this means I'm going to have to get off the pony and go looking for trouble There's, I see trouble over there let's go find it see to me that looks like a crab claw Cat face spider, okay. Alright, we've caught all of the butterflies and the stinging insects, so we don't need to go picking on them now. We just need to go and find um, these things. Oh, I know. Actually, maybe they're further back. No, there's also garlic in here, which we're going to need if we want to make any more um, potions of bug repellent, pellants, bug repellent juice, not bug repellent potions. I know that would be right up Gelfie's alley. Okay, that looks like another cat face, right? But we'll grab it anyway, just in case it's not. Okay, so that's a cat face. Spider. Oh, wait, what's that? That looks like an army ant. Grab it too, because we can. Yep. Okay. I know, I'm trying very hard. Well, okay, I'm not trying very hard not to wear out my bug net. I'm crossing my fingers very hard that it doesn't wear out before I'm ready to replace it. Which, you know, isn't that far off because I've got I've got the webbing. I'm not the webbing, the netting I need. Okay, so that looks like another army ant. Yeah.
So my only other theory is that garden spiders might be found out near the temple. Um, that the, the Greek temple near Lake Canna and that might be the only place they spawn. So maybe they're, they're really rare and they just spawn in a particular spot. Um, so we're going to, once we've given, we're going to check out where the, okay, is that another cat? That might be another cat face spider. So I'm going to do two things. We're going to come back here in a couple of days. And we're going to see if maybe there's an alternate to cat face spiders. And maybe the garden spider spawns here. Or maybe it spawns in amongst all of those friendly spiders that we, that we were chasing out near the waterfall, near the fishing spot. Um, and the last thing we'll check is the Greek temple. Alrighty, um, I've lost my pony again. The only other thing I can think of is it's actually further around in the woods. I know, how can I lose a white pony on a grey day? Well, you see, it's like this. It's easier than it sounds. Um, and there is one other spot I haven't checked. And I probably should. There's like this little pond in the woods. I don't think there's black widows in this area. I know there are stinging, stinging spiders, uh, things, bees, wasps. There you go. That's right, there are wasps. I should try and find those and annoy them. I mean, catch one. Uh, right I'm looking for now is a spider. And I, I don't know where it is. So, and I also have a bunch of dragonflies to catch before the end of autumn. So there, there is a, there, there will be some swamp. Whoa. There'll be some swamp um, things in our future. All right. I know I love sunflowers, but I hate the fact that the black widows love them too. <laughs> They never used to. It used to be all right to run through them. And then one day they were added and we're like, oh no. I see something. Oh, it's grass. Go on, tell me I found the one patch of sunflowers that there are no black widows in. That would be awesome. All right, come on, harmonica. Just gonna head this way. So the very last really hard to see thing we've got is gonna be the um the longhorn beetle. I suspect I've missed a couple of them because I just have not seen them on the trees. Um that's okay. Oh, what's that? Oh yeah, that's a herb. It's 1.33 in the morning. What am I doing? All right, I'm trying to find a bridge and we'll see if we can head on home. Oh, that is not where I want to be. Uh, I may be drowning very soon. Oh no, the pony will be fine. I can teleport her out of there. All right, I need the help I'm stuck button because, because we will not be able to get out of that pond. Right. I know, this is what happens when you go roaming through the woods at night. We'll slot the pony, we'll get her out of the pond. Sorry, harmonica, I did not mean to leave you there. Uh, 
and now I'll try and find my way home. Let's go. Okay, so we want to go back this way. Whoa, that's a spider. I wonder if that's what we're looking for. I oh, know, I'm going to fall on my nose the way I'm going. No, I think it's a, yeah. It's a spider we already have, but that's good to know that there are occasionally spiders just sitting in the forest. Where is my map? I need to go that way. And it was so much easier to see in the dark too. Alrighty, and then this should take me to a bridge, maybe. Yes, here we go. All right, we'll, we'll investigate this area of the world a little bit better later. Uh, yeah, we should have gone that way. Me 20 in the morning. I'm actually not sure I'm going to make it home. But let's keep going. Go, girl, go. Uh, I've got a tuk-tuk somewhere up here, haven't I? Up this way. If it takes one hour, we'll, we'll take it. To one hour to Oahu Beach. Yes. That'll get us home quicker. And we better hurry our tushies inside so we don't fall on our faces. Pop him in there. And we'll get some sleep. There we go. She can have a couple of hours. She'll be fine. Oops, I received something in the mail. Grab the baby. Good morning, Zane. Yeah, I did not stop to um, to check anything. Chips and tofu. He loves that stuff. Alrighty. Oops, cooking show. Well, how do you think mommy knows how to cook chips and tofu, Zane? Pistachio cookies, huh? Maybe for your birthday. Alright, there is a bunch of stuff that needs to go... I know, this is the end of season rush. Golden silk or weaver, I'm pretty sure we have one of those already. I know, I'm doing it the hard way, not deliberately. There it is. Alright, so we don't need that. Man, I need to talk to the cat. I need a garden spider kitty. I'll even feed you, look. I know, she wants a cuddle. There you go, beautiful kitty. Fat purr. Man, I love it. Alrighty. So, we'll pop these away. We're going to go out to the Greek temple, I think, first up. And then we might... Hang on, let me just find my cod and we'll put the cod up there. There we go. Now we're not going to sell it by accident. Beautiful. Okay, truffles. Seeing as you're volunteering. Hi, boy. No, come. Uh, uh. Rude pony. Radio. So, while it is daylight, we're going to head on over to the Greek temple to see if we can find a garden spider. And while we're in that neck of the woods, ow, we might. Sorry, truffles. Go round the tree. We might, um, actually, what am I doing? Oh, all right. We'll go to Spoonie and we'll do the thing. Um, while we're in that neck of the woods, what we might do is head on out to the islands to grab some more bugs. Just to see how we go. So Greek temple time. We'll um, go this way. We'll angle up the hill, just have a quick look at my map, make sure I'm on course. So I actually want to go about, oops, 
I'm going to go about here. So let me just to about there. Just angle the pony in the right direction. Hopefully. Okay, there's Canna Lake. So what we're looking for is that little hidden, which I think is actually just off to my left. Ah, oh, no, 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 go that way, girl. Boy, pony. So we go down here. We should drop ourselves right into the temple area. Boom. Now, it's daylight, so we have a fairly good chance of seeing things before we run into them maybe okay all right that does not look like what we're after and the thing next to it looks like a mosquito so we're going to ignore that and hopefully it won't eat me before i catch this okay cat face there it goes that was a mosquito rat of oh no that was a hornet right okay so you I lost something. What was it? That was probably the spider we're looking for. All right. You have to move a little carefully through here then. Which is really hard when you get stuck in these trees. Okay. Okay, there's another hornet over here. That's fine. We've got a health. What I'm after is there's a spider uh, on the it's on top. Where'd it go? There it is. Okay, that looks like a green link spider. Let's um let's catch it anyway. I oh, know I'm gonna get stung again. No, it's green crab. All right, so I have seen redbacks or black widows on these flowers as well. Um, so maybe maybe they intersperse with these other spiders here. Ow. All right, I'm just going to run through here. So what I'm hoping... I know, annoying. Uh, what I'm hoping is just get down low enough to see them maybe silhouetted on the flowers or up above them. And I'm hoping is the garden spider maybe out here. I know that hornet is so going to sting me in a minute. hitting the volume control uh, with my shoulder okay I know here it comes so I was kind of hoping that I could see I could see them in here just get rid of those two all right but that doesn't seem to be the case so maybe um, maybe I need to come back and check that out again uh, we'll run up to the top of this hill. Alright, and then I think... Yeah, where's my pony? Hey, truffles. Alright, we're just going to go over the cliff here. Uh, down there is the way to the, the tuk-tuk. I'm just going to go for a quick look over here to see if we can see any spiders that maybe I haven't seen before.
Okay, no, that's just the way the leaves are folded. Okay. And now we're going to head on out to the, um, the islands. But we'll come back to the Greek temple in a couple of days and we'll just see what's respawned, where the old spiders were, now that we've scared the ones that they spawned in with. It's the 10th of fall. I know, I have such a speedy little pony. This is what he's like when you're on 10 hearts. The unicorns are faster. Um, and I often, I often get quite dizzy uh, with them. We have not hunted dragonflies yet either. We need to do that. But I don't want to be roaming those swamps at night because I keep stepping in things I shouldn't. Ow, sorry Zora. Okay. All right, now let's see if we can find these these beetles. That does not look like it, but we will catch it anyway. It's a neon tortoise shell. A neon tortoise, my bad. What shell, what am I on? But you can see, you can see that wiggle behavior so much more clearly at the moment because of the way the sun is. All right, that looks like a tiger beetle right here. that I think that is a beetle maybe right here it will know in a minute I mean I'm probably just seeing things because it's wishful but um, let's check it'll rattle or something very shortly no that really it is a beetle right there Yes, all right. That is one of the hardest beetles in the game to catch because you can't see it. All I could see was a, like a little blur of movement. That's that's a weight off my shoulders, that, that is. One longhorn beetle. Let's not accidentally trade that. I will cry. Um, right. So now what we're chasing... Okay, it's probably not... Oh, fiddlesticks. Um, it's probably not that. We're, we're chasing a couple of the big... All right, I don't think we're after this one, but just in case. We're chasing a couple of the big stag beetles now. All right. Fruit beetle, yes. All right, so the, the stag beetles should be... <laughs> should be relatively easy to find. This looks like a dog's bane. We'll just grab it anyway. Um, yeah, it's a load off. Once you get the longhorn beetle, it's a load off. And this is the place I found it in both my playthroughs. For Camille and Zora. I, you know, I don't think I did any bug catching Whoops, with, um, with Greta now that I think about it. And I think the reason for that is the bugs weren't in the game. It was just simple. Simple, no bugs in game. There is one right there. And I'm curious, there, right there, to see whether that's another longhorn beetle. No wonder I missed them on, on uh, Wahoo Beach itself. another longhorn beetle okay so that beetle is wow okay so that was probably one of the beetles i startled and did not see a couple of nights back as well radio that is so good to know so there are three patches now where i think we can rely on finding them with a relative kind of certainty okay let's see if we can get the rest of these um these stag beetles so I need a horned uh, dynastid. 
What's that? That looks like a dog's bane. A uh, leaf beetle, possibly. Yeah, it definitely is. On dog bane leaf beetle. Why am I bothering? Because it's there. Ah. That was a ladybug. That's okay. And this is a dog bane leaf beetle. Boom. I know, we scared them away. We're very bad. Let us eat cake to get to the other end of the island quickly. Nom nom nom. Boom. Okay, run. I know. All the way back up here. Because the angle of the trees is... Um, is different now. I swear there is a beetle somewhere on these trees and I always miss it. Or nearly always miss it. Or maybe this is my wishful thinking patch. Yep, okay, that's my wishful thinking patch. Uh, right, there it. there's one there. Let's get that. That's the one I usually miss. And I nearly absent-minded, they just kept walking. Radio, that's that one done. There's one there. I love it when they're like a bright colour because you can see them. I think there's one there as well actually. That might be another long long horn beetle thing. So I'm pretty almost 100 percent sure that's that's a beetle of some kind. Oops. Okay. Alright, so we're gonna go over here. See there's there is one. Actually, I think that might be a four spot sap. Let's catch it just to make sure, because it is really hard to see. And longhorn beetles are really hard to see. No, I think that is a four spot sap, because I can see spots. Yeah. It kind of gives it away, you know, the four spot sap has spots. All right. I love to that, well, okay, I don't love, but anyway. I appreciate the cleverness now in the beetles being on different sides of the tree. Donk. Except when I don't see them and they run away before I can catch them. Yeah. And there goes another one. <laughs> oh man. All right. I'm. right. It's fine. We, we're good. There is one other spot I want to check if we can get back there in time. And we might actually go to the little fishing spot on the other side of the... Um, on the other side of Wahoo Beach and just run around through the trees in there for a little bit. Um, I know. I'm just really pleased that we caught the Longhorn because that thing is a menace. Hi Truffles, let's go boy. There you go Pony, well done. All right, let's try not to run over the scorpion this time. What are you doing? Okay, there's the honeypot ant. There's one scorpion and I think we... Oh, there's the other scorpion. Radio, we're good. Boom. Back to Wahoo Beach. Okay. So we got some good theories and so we've sorted them out. Um... Right, I wanted to go to the other end. But I also wanted to check out these trees as well. There's a red one there. We'll scare that. Ah, that looks like something I don't want to scare. See how it's quite much bigger? Let's see what that is. Maybe it'll be one of our missing, um, you know, big crunchy bug things. It's a Miyama stag. I think I've got one of those already. Yeah. That's okay, let's pocket that. Now, I'm trying to work out where the next beetle is so I don't scare it. There's one. 
right there. It's probably not one we're after. I think that might be a fruit beetle, actually. Oops. Scarab beetle. Don't. I know. I always muddle them. Well, I don't muddle them. I, I just tend not to see them. There is a, a, there's a stag, but it's one we've got. It's a cyclomatus. Uh, we will grab it anyway if we can just in case it's you know a variation and I, and I don't know what it is cyclomatus stag radio I figured pedal sticks I, I missed that completely Okay, that's a little green one. We probably don't need that. We might need that one though. That looks like a different, and maybe that's a saw stag. Doesn't matter, we'll catch it anyway and then decide if we can keep it later. We've only got about, was it two more beetles left? Saw stag, there we go. Okay, what do we got? There's one over there. What's that? That's really big and red. I, I know I've seen little and red. I just have not seen big and red before. Oh. It's a giant stag and it's one we're missing yes how many more bugs is that now one no one two three we're only missing three so horned atlas horned elephant we need the horned dynastid that's it that's the only one we're missing out of the beetles and then we can go nuts with the dragonflies all right, we are getting there very, very soon. Yes. I know, I should just get this part of the game done early on, I think. But it's hard to when you're... um. Okay, that's all right, that was a fruit beetle. It's midnight again. What's that? Let's let's get this thing, whatever it is. It's a big beetle. I know, there's your scientific name, big beetle. Um, you want more detail? It's a big wiggly beetle that we already had. There's one more somewhere around here. All right. So what I wanted to do before we um, really, man, my horse has attitude. I'm not going to come and get you. I'm sleeping. Fine, pony boy. Fine. We're going to head on down to the beach over here. I might just grab some cake to facilitate a little bit of speed eat much better all right we'll head on down to the beach over here and we're going to look for beetles on the way down uh except i forget which side of the tree that rock all right maybe we'll start over oh wait what's that that's one let's see if that's our missing beetle beetle Nope, it's a Miyama stag. That's okay though. 
We now have the side of the tree that these guys might be on. Which will make it a little bit easier to find them, hopefully. This one here. Let's grab that one. What are you, sassy beetle in a minute? Horned elephant beetle. No, but. Oh, there's something over here too. I know. Sorry, sorry, Zora. We are we are beetle hunting. We are trying to get the last beetle. However, I think this one will be the last beetle because I think you need a nap. I know, I'm trying to get through the palm leaves. Golden turtles. All right. So, okay, we, we may need to visit this particular patch of trees again. Um, okay. Oops. 251. Not helpful game. I know, it just gets a clash of what you want to look at. And it just, it's like, well, do I show you this? Or do I show you this? I think there's a wall there that I can't get. Alrighty, time to head for home. I know, we caught, we caught at least two beetles that we didn't have. And now we have one more to go. And it should be a fairly easy to see beetle. It's, it's a large-ish kind of beetle. I need to clean up my farm first. But I think, guys, we'll pop the baby in the cot. Um, on that note, it's time for me to go. If you enjoyed this episode, please hit like. If you want to see more, please hit subscribe. And uh, I'm going to put this carriage to bed and I'll check you later. There you go. Get some sleep. <laughs>